deep, who's at your door? It's your girl, Max. Go grab yourself some snacks. Sit back and relax, cause you effing it up at Max. You effing it up at Max, yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while, how y'all been? I know I've been away for a long time, but I'm cleaning here right now. I'm starting some spin cleaning. I'm actually, um, today I'm gonna be unboxing some of my Christmas presents. <laughs> That's how behind I am this year. A lot's been going on, that's why you haven't seen me since my birthday, that was the last time I vlogged. I was supposed to be doing everyday vlogs this year, but a lot's been going on, it's just not happening how I want it to. But I hope from today that I'll be able to just be consistent. The noise in the background is my grandchild and her dad making a nice noise, but yeah. They're having fun spinning coins. <laughs> so yeah, um, how you all been? What y'all been up to? What's the do? Tell me what I've gone. It's been a while, man. It's been a lot going on with my family. A lot going on with me. I haven't been feeling myself. I ain't been feeling like vlogging. I haven't been feeling like doing anything, to be honest. Life is like... It's not kicking my ass, but it's like it's trying to. And I'm just trying to get back on top now. So, um... Today, as you can see, I've got some perfumes on the I'm going to clean all of these shelves first, and then I'm going to show you some of my new perfumes. These are my old ones that I have so far. We'll go through them one by one as I clean them off. Some of them are gathering dust because, like I say, I'm single. Been single for over 20 years. Don't get no dates, so I haven't been anywhere. Last time, I was trying to do the videos about getting body date body ready, and yeah, date didn't happen. Yeah, so such is life. And so I'm here again, single still, um, going into maybe 30 years of singleness it looks like. <laughs> but yeah, so my, my perfumes are showing it. My perfumes are very dusty because they don't get used, I don't, I don't go anywhere. So they're just here. It's another thing that's been getting me down guys, it's like I just don't do anything, don't go anywhere, have nobody, have no friends. <laughs> I'm just a loner. You all see me here smiling and laughing but uh, yeah, my life ain't that great. It's kind of like lonely. So, I'm happy to have you guys, so I can have a little chat and let you all see what I've been up to and what I'm getting up to. I've also made myself a home gym, by the way, since you all last saw me. Well, we'll see that on another video. We can have a look at my home gym and maybe do a little workout together. But today, like I said, I'm unboxing perfumes, letting you all know how I've been feeling and what's been going on. Like I said, I can't go into detail, but a lot has been happening. Some of you may be um, subscribed to my daughter's channel, so you probably know some things. But <laughs> apart from those things that she mentioned, a lot more has happened. <laughs> Trust. And even yesterday, as I thought that, all right, today I'm going to film. If it's kind of like slightly back to normal, boom, something else happens. So yeah, life is crazy. So we'll just keep your loved ones close. Make sure you tell each other that you love each other every single day and try to just be the best person you can be because you just don't know what people have planned for you and what could be around the corner. But yeah, life is funny. But I just keep it moving. All right, so I've got all these shelves to clean. Once I've cleaned them, I'll come back to you all and start showing you my perfumes, naming them out, telling you who I got them from and stuff and such. Alright, so I'm back guys. I'm just going to clean out this um, smoky eye palette. I've never had a smoky eye though, because as you can see, I don't wear makeup and I don't know how. <laughs> That's why you never see me in makeup, because I don't know how to wear makeup. I've never worn makeup in my life. My big old 55 years, plain face, no makeup. I was going to wipe all of these, but it's definitely. <laughs> but you can see anyway, I'm, I'm plain face all the time, don't have to wear makeup, but yeah, people be getting me stuff, and uh, I asked for this, my, my daughter bought me this for Christmas, years and years and years and years ago, this has been travelling around all different countries, coming back to England, yo, this has been doing the most, but going on my face, right, so this was on one of the shelves, as you can see on my bed, these are all the things that was on the shelves. What I'm going to do, guys, is let me show you. Here's my Christmas bag. Gathering dust. This bag is full of perfumes. 
like what I have on the bed. But this one, these ones are more special and exciting. So I first of all, I'm going to show you these. What I'm going to do is on this shelf are going to be the special perfumes, like the really sexy ones I've got. But I think I'll put those on for dates and like sexy things. The ones here will probably be everyday and then down here daytime. But yeah, you're, I'm gonna start putting them in categories. So let's get started. Right in this bag, in this gift bag here, it's joint perfumes in here. So basically, I'll start off with this. This is not a perfume, but it's like a fragrant mist. Now this came with this. These are Britney Spears. Oh, this one got a dust. Hold on, let me wipe it off. So this first um, unboxing I'm doing here, Britney Spears. Midnight Fantasy the perfume and the body spray. They smell absolutely gorgeous. I wish I could let you lot smell, but I'm gonna spray it in the air for me again. Oh my gosh! It's sweet, it's delightful. This is springtime. So what I'm gonna do, because it's kind of springy and daytimey, I'm gonna set it right here. So it's just gonna have its own shelf. That's staying there. Now this gift was from my son Chai. So shout out to Chai, mommy loves you and she loves her fantasy, Brittany. Right, on to the next. Uh, here I have some Michael Kors. Let's have a look what's in here. Right, well the picture's been torn off so um, let me open it for you. I can open it. Well, I'm about to tear up the box so I'm going to just take them out now then. And just have them out. Because the box is obviously not cooperating. As you can see, I like to keep boxes for my um, perfumes so I can stand like the perfumes in front of the box. But this box is actually bummed. Oh, they all come in little boxes. Okay, cute. I haven't really looked up my Michael Kors, so guys, we're doing this together. <laughs> Sorry, I'm excited. All right, so we've got oh, see, it says sexy. After I said I want all my sexy things over there, do you know what? I'm gonna keep them in this and then probably just stand up there. But let's, um, let's see what um, sexy amber smells like. Let's have a look. So if anyone's familiar with these, then you can comment in the comments and tell me what. Oh, it's one of those where you have to like get a little thing and. What is it? Here it is. We can't really get the stick. So I don't really like how you apply it, guys. That's the applicator. That's some little thing inside. So what I'm gonna do when I see, I can hardly smell it. When I do it, I'm gonna do this. There. See. <laughs> You get something on your wrist because I, I mean I know I want this. Ah, uh, 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 anyway, let me put this back. Smell test. It's nice. So it doesn't really smell sexy to me. It's kind of just warm, casual, but it's nice. So that one's the sexy amber. All right, let's put that back. All right, sexy amber. You can go back. Next along is wonderful lust. No, Wanderlust. Oh, did you like the bottle, by the way, guys? I didn't really show you the bottle. Let me, each time I take them out, I'll show you the bottles. So you can comment. Right, so that one's sexy. The bottle was a long, slim bottle, if you can kind of remember. I'm sorry I didn't show you. This one I'm going to show you. It's cute. Cute little bottle right here. And this one is Wanderlust. Let's see how this is. I wonder if the applique thing is the same or does it spray? Break it. What do you do? Just twist it. Oh, oh it's another one of those. Oh. <laughs> Stop it in my nostril. <laughs> okay, can't smell it like that, so I'm gonna do this again. Mm. Mm. Oh, a bit too much came out. Oh, that is nice. This is kind of um citrusy. Citrusy and um, what's that word? Musk. It's nice anyway. I like it better than th now. This smells sexy. This one smelled more light and springy, but this actually smells. This has got a sexy smell. This is nice. Oh, I'd can't class this as sexy. So this is um Wonderlust, and you can see the writing really small on the bottle. Cute little bottle. These are all like samples, I believe, but they come in a set. Michael Kors set, I guess. I don't know. But it's a gift set. It's nice. I got these, this set, by the way. I got this from my daughter, Diana. 
Shout out to Diana. Diana. Because <laughs> I was going to say DXINX, but it came out as Diana. <laughs> right, anyway, but her. Yeah. Alright, so this is also Gorgeous by Michael Kors. Let's see how the box, how the box looks. That's how the box looks. I like the box. I like those colours. I actually have to dress like this. Stay right there, guys. Where is that dress? Come here. Look at this, guys. Matches the box. Sex dress. Do you know what I'm saying? Ooh. Anyway. Over the next few days. So you're gonna be doing all for the head probably tomorrow. We're gonna be doing all for the head, which is that closet over there. Huh. There's a lot going on. Trust <laughs> me. I think my wigs are alive. <laughs> There's a lot going on in there. But we're gonna be sorting it out tomorrow. Right, so this is um, gorgeous. Plain little bottles, not really exciting. So hopefully the perfume is more exciting than the bottle. Let's see. Okay. Oh, it's gorgeous. This is gorgeous. And this actually matches the dress. <laughs> I can imagine wearing that dress with this on. Yeah, it matches. It's, it's actually gorgeous, like what it says on the box. Do you want to smell cameraman? I mean, go. It's nice, isn't it? Mm. Do you want to smell some of the other ones? Yeah. This one is lust. Mm. And this one is. See, so you can hardly smell this one. This is sexy. See, it's hard in there. So, yeah, right. So, that's the Michael Kors kit. Shout out to that. And look, it's so cute. It says inside when you open it. Hello, gorgeous. You see that? <laughs> So let's put that one back. Okay, so this one's going to be the first, actually, out of all my unboxing to go up on the shelf. So let's choose a shelf for it. So it's going to go over here on the sexy side. So what I'll do, because they're a little set, I'll just put them on the bottom. So they're easy to get to. Put them on a little small. All right. There's another Michael Kors. No, it's not actually. It's Machino. Sorry. I've got Machino here. I also got this for my daughter. And this smells divine. What I need to remind myself. And plus, show you the cute bottle, look, guys. Oh, little beer. Oh, talk about beers. Show them my Berber. Look, I love beers, guys. My big bear in bed over there. And I've got Valentino behind the cushion there. Yeah. So you can see why I love beers. And I call my keys Keezy Bear. Obviously, she's my human bear. Right, let me open this. Machine or you know, I see your mod and the applicator. See, you guys, the applicator comes out so you can use it. I don't need to, it just smells gorgeous. Please tell me, you know, Machino's not playing yet. So that's Machino, it just says Toy 2 basically. So, Machino Toy 2, I give it 8 out of 10. This whole box set here, I'll give 9 out of 10. This right here, 10 10. Brittany, 10 10. It's so good. Right, I'm going to put Machino here because he's little, so he can go over the small ones. Right, next. Oh, yes, we're unboxing, aren't we? We'll get to those in a minute. Now, with this, this one is special to me because it's the big size. Because as you can see, I've got one here. It's, it's a different box. This box is all velvet. And this is just like a big but i told my daughter that i love this and so she went out and got me the big one because i i don't know i think there's a little bit perfect left in the toe <laughs> there's nothing left in there so now i've got a new one let's see if the bottle is the same i guess it is but just bigger right oh yeah oh look at that heel guys that's a fun so that's carolina herrera good girl now this I don't have to smell because this is one of my favourite perfumes. Love it. Love it. This is gorgeous. Now this, I feel sexy. I have been on a couple of dates where the guy said they, they was following me everywhere, the way I smell. I was like, oh, thank you. <laughs> and it was this. So yeah. Yes. Carolina, Javier. Shout out to you. Your perfume is doing the do. Now what I should do actually is do what I usually do, which is take it out. Oh great, I'm not sure the box. Right, take it out, close up the box. 
I'm going to put them both on the same shelf since they're both the same. Which is going to be on top of Britney. Alright, so you go there and the shoe. Go there. Hitbox just a bit out so you can see the big girl name. Alright, please don't fall off on nobody's head. And you can go here. How's that look, please? Yeah, it's good. Alright, All right, guys, it's coming together, you know. Okay, next is the Christmas bunch. So that, so far, Christmas bunch. Chai, Diana. Bought that for myself. Diana, Diana. Alright, last one now in here is the Juicy Couture. Now, I can't remember if this was Chai or Diana. This is Diana too, isn't it? I can't remember. I believe this is from Baina too. Juicy Couture. Don't get on my nerves. This one I don't even have to smell, guys. This I recommend. 10, 10, 10, 10, 100 out of 10, yeah? Anybody who wants something that smells good, sweet, sexy, spicy, or everything, all in a bottle, this is it. This perfume right here makes a big statement. Love it. I love the bottle. Look at that beautiful bow. The bow should be around the front, really. Or is it different that way? No, it's meant to be here around the front and the rest of the way. Beautiful bottle. So even when the perfume's done, I'm gonna wanna keep that. Look at that crested crown there. And the, this looks like a diamond. And the, the box is quite cute too. So this needs its own shelf. And I think, do you think up here? Or this one? I think it needs to be more up so people can really see that, right? Let's close the box. Let's get the box up there first. Juicy the corner, and then we'll put it right there. And then put juicy right here. Okay. Okay. Alright, so that's the unboxing of the bag. Now we're going to go back into perfumes that I originally had in the first place. Because they were also gifts. None of my perfumes are actually bought by me apart from that one. My Gucci rush. <laughs> Let me put Gucci up. But I usually put Gucci on my top shelf, so I can still sit on the top shelf. I'm used to him being there. Um, actually, you know something? Bring Gucci across here. It's daytime, because I do wear him in the day. Alright. Um, these are my daytime perfumes now. This black suede smells really nice. It's like unisex. It doesn't say it on the thing, but it, it smells unisex to me. I got this from Chai, he got this from Turkey, when he was in Turkey, he bought me this. I don't think I have the box. Wait a second, here it is. No, this is Black Dusk. This is Black Suede. So I don't have the box for it. Very nice, seven out of 10, I like it. It's daytime perfume, so it shall go here. All right, next one, Gucci Guilty. This is from my daughter, Diana. So this shall go here with the other Gucci. Very nice, another nice daytime perfume, seven out of 10. Um, Gucci brush, I give nine out of 10. Seven, seven, nine, 10, 10, 10, 10, eight. I did say eight, but I didn't. And seven. Right, back to these. This now, this is the Black Dusk. Also from Chai. No, this one is from Daniel, actually, my son Daniel. And it came from England, so. It's another daytime perfume. I'll give that one a. It's not really one of my favourites. Remind myself, I don't really wear this one much. Oh! Oh, it's okay. Six and a half. This is nice. Alright, another one from my son Daniel. These I got on Mother's Day a couple of years ago. Both of them at the same time. This one is Fleur Bloom and that one is Black Dusk. Fleur Bloom is one of my favourites for a daytime perfume because it's very flowery. So it's got a flowery fragrance. Let's have a little reminder. This is kind of springtime, definitely. See? It's very springy, very flowery. Mm. Yeah. Let's put one up here. It's another daytime. Oh, 
It doesn't fit. Should I put it in the black suede then? Let's see if you can put it there. Okay. Oh, my perfumes are looking good, guys. All right. Pure excess. Bottle's empty. I'm keeping it because I love it. I love the suede box, velvety kind of suede box. The reason why I'm keeping this pure excess is because I want to remember the name of it because this was 10 10. So this is 10 out of 10. This is another one for my daughter. Um, for her birthday, I think I got this. So it's still got up here at the top. Since it's empty and I want to refill, I'll just leave it there just to make my shelves look nice and to go along with the perfumes that I have already. Okay, this here is. Beyonce Heat. This is an old time perfume. When Beyonce came out with Heat, it was a big thing, but we're in 2024 now, so it's not really all that big. But <laughs> it's still a nice perfume. Yep. I'll still give this one a eight and a half. Beyonce. She can come over here as one of the sexies because it is sexy. I'll put that there. So this is all my sexy perfume, guys. This is all my daytime I'm trying to be sexy slash daytime this is just daytime and casual everyday wear over here all right i'm coming up to my last now this is from um turkey this is from um chai it's called far away very nice fragrant love the bottle with the little tassel detail it's lovely and they've got the writing there and the writing almost looks kind of middle east and it's, it's so cute very cute chai knows how to pick things shout out to chai again because this one is amazing this one is actually really nice but like I said guys, I haven't really been anywhere to actually get to wear my perfume, so, so I don't remember how they smell. Like this one can take its little spot right here, oops, upside down, right here, box in there, perfume there, let's put it to a slide maybe, so let's put you over here. I want it to have a little slide but be able to see the, um, the front of it. I just don't want no one to come flying in my room and knock it down. No. Yeah, meaning her. Let me put it this way. Can you hear all that noise she's making in the middle of my video? Right. She's actually a banshee, by the way, guys. <laughs> You'll see her, think she's cute, but she's wailing. She's three, going on four, and yeah, she's at that age. Okay, we're down to Anais. Now, this I got last year Christmas from Diana. Anais is very springy. Summertime, it's floral, smell it. Very floral. Mm -hmm. But it's a cute summery perfume. So I'll class that as a daytime. So what I'll do is I'm going to have to share a shelf with Brittany. There we go. How's my perfumes looking, guys? How's it looking? The keys looking good? Mm -hmm. Right, we've got a little set here, guys. It's, um, Ted Baker set. It's basically soap, lotion, and a body spray. As you can see, I love it. Body spray is nearly finished. <laughs> I just used the body spray all last summer. So I got this also last year. So, um, yeah. This I got from Diana. I shall put it here because it is sexy and gorgeous and needs to be over here with these sets. I wish it could fit on top of it. It would be so nice. Oh, yo, there's a shelf here. Beyonce. Okay, let's put it up here with Beyonce. One. Two, three. Yeah. There we go, guys. How's that looking? What you got cooking? Stand, man. Are you absolutely like drunk? Alright, so that's that. Last one. Oh, no, it's not last. I've still got. Um, but this is not mine, by the way, guys. This is my son's, but he seems to have made refuge for it in my room. So, what I'm going to do is put it right at the top there with my bath bag. Um, this is an Arabian man's cologne, natural spray. It is gorgeous. He loves it so much. It smells so good. He got this from his um, ex brother in law. Yeah, my no longer son in law. Yeah, but he, he loves it. So he still gets it and it's still going strong. Got that years ago. I think over five years now, is that that? Okay, back to my last perfume, which is. Victor Wolf, and this is his bottle. This thing's missing. There's meant to be a um a long thing with a tag thing. It's gone. 
There was a black tag on this, guys, that look, look, looks like this. And it was on the bottle, but it seems to be missing. Let me put the lid on a different bottle, didn't I? Let's look inside the box. Yeah, but this is um, a nice perfume also, a daytime that I got from my daughter. I don't remember when, if it was a birthday or a Christmas. I wore it the other day, so I don't know why I'm spraying it. Very good. 9 out of 10. So, this one is um, the Victor Wolf Flower Bomb. And if you want to try it out and check it out, let's go and check it out. Victor Wolf, let me put this in shot, isn't it, in there? So you can see. It's very nice. So, hopefully, if you're interested in any of these perfumes and want to go and try it out like this, there you are, spread out nicely in the groin. I'm going to put this one down here with a machina and Michael Kors, Victor Rolf. And there we have my beautiful perfume display. And I have this one too, but it's finished. This is Karama, it's really brilliant. This is, I give a hundred out of a thousand million out of ten. This is really, really gorgeous. This was just a sample, and I would love to find this back. Yeah, just got into my hands. Kind of by accident, hey! <laughs> but I loved it and I kept it. So yeah, and no, I didn't steal it. It was given to me, but um, unknowingly given to me. <laughs> so yeah, that was a nice surprise in the bag that I got with some other goodies, and then that happened to be in it. So it played its course. I have some mini um, in lights here. That smell really good. These are basically samples of um, some name brand perfumes, but I can't actually see if we can tell you which ones they were or are because I haven't really used them either. But I have smelt them and they do smell 10 10. These are really nice, but I'm um, sorry, I can't. Um, let me see if I can show you the label. Perfumes, they're really good, they're really, really nice. Alright, I'm just going to um, put in the daytime section. There. And, there. and my godson, he did have a place up on the shelf, so I'll just put him back. And I got this fancy cigarette at my daughter's house. She, uh, she said someone gave her a gift box and it had these box of slim cigarettes in it. And I thought it was cute because it said Vogue on it, like Vogue magazine. So. What I want to do, you know them boxes that say break for emergency, I want to get one of those and put it in. So if any smokers come to my house and they're maybe dying for a cigarette, I don't even want to give them to it, give them it. I just think it's nice and cute. Just to keep it there. Had it for a while now. So yeah, I'm glad my son isn't noticed. <laughs> 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 if you're a smoker, you know. You've got chip, you know. Alright, my bank cards usually go up here, so I'll put them up there. Just putting all the stuff that goes back on this shelf now. But as you can see, I've cleared. Oh, my glasses. They're supposed to be on the top shelf, but I've got too many perfumes now. I never had a lot of perfumes before. These are my Ray Bans, my um, Ray Ban sunglasses. I don't know if everyone's getting these Ray Bans that you can video with. I would like to be able to buy those one day, but like I said, I've been working on YouTube. I don't get monetized, so it's not as if I'm getting money. I don't get paid to be on YouTube. I'm just here trying to get paid. So maybe one day I'll be able to buy Ray Bans. <laughs> that you can record with. But right now, because I'm buying up now. Come in, I get peer. Come in, I get enough view. We want my viewers to tell them friend and tell them friend, friend and tell them friend, 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 friend. If you come watch, if you're not in Max or Max can get peer. She know I get nothing to do. <laughs> no, seriously though. Tell your family, tell your friends, tell your exes, tell the foreigners that you just meet on the street. Just tell the dog cat everybody, yeah? Come watch Ethan Up and Max, because guess what? She's coming with the content and it's going to get bigger and bigger as she gets bigger. But right now, I'm okay, I can't do much about this because I've got a lot to tell you lot still because my life, like I said, is not what you all think it is. Nowhere near. Yeah? Some of you will probably start crying if you know my real life. <laughs> Seriously, I cry every day. So, and I, don't, and I actually get up and cry every day. So. That's another thing that I need to try and get under control because like I said life is not what I want it to be but hopefully one day it will be if I hang out with you lot enough maybe one day it will be but in the meantime here's my shelves done clean 
Fancy looking. Hopefully, let me stand over here, not from over here. Oh yeah, I like that. Yeah, and I can see them all now, and now they're all out of the bag. And anytime I want to choose a perfume, I know where to go for my sexies. I know where to go for the daytime and daytime sexy at the top, and just every day. All right. Love you guys. By the way, what if you're gonna notice something different about my intro on this video and my outro on this video? Hopefully, my next video you can tell me what you think. Until then, love you. Bye. Then up the mats, yeah. Make sure you come back, yeah, for some more chat, yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, do all of that.